I am a celebrity. South Africa's newest campmate Mylene Class, 45, previously shared a frosty relationship with her former hearsay bandmate Kim Marsh, 46, after the pair found fame together in their early 20s. Here's the stars Mylene Class, Kim Marsh, Suzanne Shaw, Noel Sullivan and Danny Foster first came together on the reality show Pop Stars in 2001. The band won the show and were moved into a house in London together as music mogul Nigel Nasty Lithgow prepared to launch the group. However, the high from being selected didn't last forever. With I Am A Celebrity. Get me out of here. Star Mylene and morning live presenter Kim going through a nasty falling out. Kim quit the band in 2002 after a series of blazing rows with her bandmate. There was one particularly heated argument on the Jerry Springer show in the U.S., where the singer's feud blew up in front of cameras, as Kim exclaimed before the duo went on set. You're just a s asterisk g who can't stop getting her t's out. Kim wrote. Me and Mylene had a slanging match but someone split us up as we were due to go on air. Going on to perform our single was horrible. At one point, I and Mylene had to put our arms around one another. It was so fake and I hated every minute of it. We had been overheard arguing by staff at the studios and the following day our row was all over the newspapers. We managed to put it behind us but the niggles remained. I wish we'd been able to explain honestly how we were feeling. But the problems festered. According to a report by People at the time, the row erupted over Kim's suspicions that Mylene has been putting her down to the other bandmates. However, the final straw that led to Kim's sensational exit was when a story was leaked to a newspaper. Kim felt utterly betrayed and told News of the World that she quit. In her autobiography, Kim wrote, I am sorry I quit through a newspaper rather than sitting down with the rest of the band. If we could have had a chat to clear the air it wouldn't have been so bitter afterwards. Kim then had little to no contact with Mylene, except for the odd chat and a few texts. However, in 2009, Kim's world was turned upside down when her baby boy Archie tragically died. Kim and her then-partner Hollyoaks star Jamie Lomas lost their little boy shortly after he was born at 18 weeks early. Despite their tense past, Kim revealed that her former bandmate was one of the first to reach out to her. She said, We hadn't really kept in contact but, being a mum herself, Mylene rang to see how I was. We were both in tears on the phone and, in the days after Archie's death, we talked more and more. We have both grown up now that we have children of our own, explained Kim. Life is too short to hold grudges and what happened back then isn't anyone's fault. I am determined not to let anything or anyone come between us again. It comes as Mylene is making her big comeback to I'm a Celeb in South Africa, after her star turn in the show back in 2006.